<laughs> Good morning, everybody. And as you'll notice, this is reassembly. But I'm actually recording my desktop because <laughs> I'd like to just quickly raise a little bit of awareness for the mod that I've recently published. AKA Lapses, the Alunda Defenders. Yes. So I said I would publish. Uh, the Olympians, which is one of my latest Red Faction fleet, fleets. Here's the original one, the Zorzak Mulius. Mulius. <laughs> but uh, yes, I said I was going to send in the Olympians, but instead, I sent in the Alanda Defenders. And I've actually uploaded that, and you can find that in the workshop for reassembly under items, workshop. And you can see here, <laughs> the good old Yolanda Defenders. <laughs> Uh, I haven't really added much to the front, just uh, two little pictures. One of just alternate color scheme, but yes, I like that. Um, so yes, and there's all the lore. I think I, I think I wrote quite a nice thing. Can you tell I enjoy writing that? <laughs> Hope you can. Uh, I added a few things, couple, uh, well, obviously an entire fleet of ships, but also a large array of highly deadly weapons. Well, when I say highly deadly, I mean decently deadly. So if I load up my current Yolanda Defender save, first thing you're going to notice is uh, the obvious solar panels, but um, that's just part of it. So effectively what I added in was the Omega Doom Beam, which is actually very powerful. I added in a small shield, and I added in a mini generator. <laughs> also, I added in a quantum rift device, a.k.a. <laughs> Uh, you can actually read there, an advanced quantum rift device warps in fully constructed ships. It does. Effectively, it's a factory, but your ships don't have to build. It's very, very nice. Also, you have your bio-containment, a.k.a. You know, a solar panel, but I prefer having it kind of be like a... Uh, what did you call it? A bio-farm, whatever. You, you, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> And then there's also the quantum defense beam, because, honestly, the B faction's PD defense, PD subsystems are kind of rubbish. The quantum defense beam is, actually, I have made decently good, but it's not, it's not as powerful as, say, a normal quantum doom beam. But, it, it, you know. Uh, and yes, so far that's all I've really added in terms of blocks. Uh, out of terms of blocks, I have added a social, the social AI behavior to the faction, so that now ships will actually call on other ships for backup. Um, ignore the shell cores, that's, uh, that's a completely different mod. And so here you'll see one of my, uh, the Alanda Savior Mama class. <laughs> so effectively, yeah, and uh, a large array of ships and structures, see Yolanda Biodome, yeah, so you don't use the little biodomes. <laughs> and yes, so if you're looking for a nice old bee challenge, don't worry, this doesn't actually replace the bees, it just, yeah, as is obvious, it just adds another little uh, faction now. This isn't actually what the main color scheme of the Yolanda Defenders is. I kept it almost like the normal bee color. It's just yellow and black. Uh, because in the end, everyone always customizes their colors. So, uh, you know. <laughs> and they are effectively just another chunk of the B faction, so I, th I thought it'd be quite nice. <laughs> so yes, everybody, you know, go go, go have a look. <laughs> Just, you know, uh, it's my first little attempt at modding, and I will be sending out, sorry, I have some chips in a bowl beneath me if you hear that scrunchling. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is my first little journey into modding, and I think it actually turned out quite nice. Reassembly modding is actually beautifully simplistic. Mr. Arthur Danskin made it very easy uh, and so yes so kindly just just have a little look just just you know find them in your game fight them kill them and build as them <laughs> you, know, you know you might you might actually have a ball because it's it's literally just b faction plus you know i i haven't i haven't i haven't edited the in uh the base blocks so you know armor is still the same so nothing's really overpowered the omega quantum doom beam sort of is overpowered but that's also just because it's the truest example of Yolandari and Rage. I might also add another laser drone, but I highly doubt it. I think we have enough laser drones. And, uh, yeah. Also, a small shield, because the bigger ones are a little too obnoxious sometimes. 
And yeah, guys, I, I hope you will enjoy. So until next time. Oh, I actually like this color screen. Co color screen? Color screen. Color screen. Quite a. I like this color scheme quite a bit. So yes, until next time. Cheerio.